Hey guys, I wanted to reach out to you and answer a couple questions that I've gotten in the group um, before I keep posting some more today and tomorrow. So about the meal plan, some of you guys have questions on the detox and the one I posted. The detox you can do for three to seven days. Totally up to you how you want to do it. Some of you have said you want to do it for three days and then continue with the plan I posted for the rest of the seven. Totally fine. You can also, if you want to do the detox longer, maybe do it for the whole seven days, but... Um, Add one more serving of carbs and delete the coconut oil or add one more serving of carbs and delete um, one of the proteins. You can alternate it a little bit, maybe add more vegetables instead. So if you need help with that, reach out. What I want you guys to do is just make sure that you're not eating when you're not hungry. As long as you're hungry, you have the meals. That detox has six to seven meals and some people say, well, I can't eat all of it, it's too much food. You don't have to eat until you're satisfied. Your body's not gonna go into starvation mode in a week. People do fast for longer than that. So eat when you're hungry. Do not eat any more than you need to just to get all the food in. Um, and if you have any questions on the recipes or the food list or the shopping list or anything, please reach out and ask. If you want suggestions on which one to do, just tell me what your goals are and I'll suggest it. If you want fast results, then I would say do the detox to cleanse yourself of all the stuff that you've had in the past with your sugars and with your um, processed foods, with um, alcohol, stuff like that. If you want to detox and get that all out of your system and then start fresh when you start another group next month, that might be a good option for you to do because it cleans your body out and then you're kind of ready to start. You get rid of some cravings, you get rid of a lot of um, uh, loss of energy. So that's a good way to start. I suggest the detox if that's what you're looking to do and if you've been kind of eating a lot of junk and I know this weekend's a holiday weekend um, for the start of this group. So that might be an option for you to do. Um, also for the Beach Body On Demand workout, there are over 700 workouts on there, over 50 programs that you can access. So honestly, that's what I do for my workouts most of the time. I don't really go to the gym anymore, maybe once every couple weeks because my son likes to play there, but those are key. And they give you cardio, they give you HIIT training, they give you strength training. Um, so you have tons of access, yoga, Pilates, prenatal workouts. So if you want access to that, you can try it for free for two weeks. Just reach out to me, message me, comment below on this video. Um, if you're in the group, comment and tag me so I see it and send you the, the link. But there are tons of options and there's also a nutrition library which has tons of recipes, meal prep videos. So it's a huge blessing of a resource for you guys and it's $99 a year, no membership um, to any gym is gonna cost you that. So that's an option for you as well. Um, what I also want you guys to make sure you do is if you're having trouble with the portions, like portion control, weighing foods and stuff like that, those little colored containers are a blessing and they're not a lot. Um, do not go to Amazon to get them because some of them are not the same size or the same colors. So ask me about those as well. Um, I use those for macros. I, I check my, I balance my macros with one app, but I use those for portion control because they help me judge portions when I'm eating out. I don't have to worry about, oh, I can't measure my dish when I'm at a restaurant. I don't have to. I just kind of visualize it because I've been using those for three and a half, almost actually four years. So it makes it a lot easier. Um, and a few of you have asked me about Shakeology. Do I sell it? I don't personally sell it, but I do through my coaching account. So I do get a little bit of credit if you get it through me. So please, if you do want it, reach out to me because if you get it through me, you have free access to my groups if you get them on supply for the next um, macros group. Um, so just message me, um, comment below, email me, um, Instagram, Facebook, whatever, and I'll help you guys with that. It's not that something that you need for the groups, but it is extremely beneficial because it's going to be a full meal for your day. It's going to give you all the fruits and vegetable servings that you need for the day, tons of vitamins and nutrients. And I honestly don't take any more multivitamins, any probiotics, no flaxseed, no matcha. I don't add anything that I used to to my shakes anymore. So yeah, it might not be cheap and it's expensive, um, but it's a quality and that's what you get. It's about the same as a Starbucks every day and I was spending about $50 for my protein shake plus probably another $70 on supplements a month. So it works out in the end. So if you guys have any other questions, please reach out. If you're in my group, I'm going to keep posting because this is gonna be on YouTube so I realize some of you are not in my group. If you're in it, I'm gonna keep posting today, I'm gonna keep posting tomorrow and we will start um, immediately on Tuesday after Labor Day weekend when we are going to hit it, hit it for seven days. If you have not taken your measurements and you plan on having a big weekend of eating and drinking Sunday and Monday, then take your measurements 
Tuesday morning before you begin. Wake up Tuesday morning, measurement and weight because otherwise if you took your measurements yesterday and you're going to eat kind of heavy, drink kind of heavy today and tomorrow, you're not going to see the loss because you might have gained today and tomorrow and by the end of the challenge you lost that but you're not going to see it. So I hope that makes sense to you. The best time to measure and weigh if you're planning a big weekend is Tuesday morning before we begin. I normally begin these groups Monday but because of Labor Day I'm starting it a day late. So again, if you guys have any questions, below, comment, tag me, and I'm looking forward to start, and I'll be sharing more information. Sorry about my voice. Um, I don't know what's going on, but have a great Sunday.